Hey guys, just wanted to make a comment on this particular video. This is a young lady who's uh, talking about regretting her abortion, and it was due to pressure from her partner. And you can, you guys can see the comment. And this is exactly why I say men need to be involved on this issue of life. Women don't get pregnant alone. Women, so many times, as I do counseling at the abortion clinics, they say if the man had stepped up, if the man would be there, if the man offered support, would not go through with the abortion. There's going to be an awful lot of men who have blood on their hands when they stand before Christ. If you're a man, don't don't cave into the pressures of being silent because you don't have a uterus. You need to speak up on this issue. If you're a man, be a man. Right? If you get a female pregnant, whether it's a one night stand, whether it's a long term relationship, don't bounce. Don't run. Don't be a coward. Don't do that. Be a man. Stand up. Take care of your kid. You don't necessarily even have to be in a relationship with the female, but you can take care of the kid. And you should off always, you know, have a level of respect for the mother of your kid. I'm a single dad, divorced, you know, was married for 18 years, ex-wife, you know, just went down a bad road of alcohol addiction. We have a 10-year-old daughter who I actually have uh, custody of right now. She has autism. Would have been real easy to run. Would have been real easy to take off. That's not what men do. Men don't do that. Men do what's hard to do. Don't leave it to the women to do what the men are supposed to do. Offer support. Stand up. Fill in the gap. Stand in the gap. Don't be a coward. You will have blood on your hands and you will have to answer. As Matthew 12, 36 and 37, every idle word and every action. We'll give an account for that.